Snap-on Training Solutions helps you get the most out of your Apollo D8 diagnostic tool. I'm Jim Moritz, Global Field Trainer and Sales Support Representative. This training module covers the controls and basic setup functions. Before operating or maintaining Apollo D8, read the safety instructions and user manual carefully, paying extra attention to the safety warnings and precautions. To install the battery pack, loosen the two screws that retain the battery compartment cover. Lift the bottom edge of the cover to remove. Put the notched end of the battery in first and push down until the battery is in place. Replace the battery cover and snug up the screws to hold the cover in place. Do not over tighten. Indicators and connectors are on the top panel. The power indicator illuminates when power is being supplied to the tool. A red light indicates the battery is charging. A green light means the battery is fully charged. An amber light means there is an issue with the battery. The power supply port is used to connect the AC-DC power supply. Use only the correct AC adapter provided with the Apollo D8. The mini USB port is used to connect Apollo D8 to a personal computer for transferring saved files and downloading software upgrades and service releases using ShopStream Connect, which is a free software available online. The micro SD card port holds the micro SD card that contains the Apollo D8 software, and the data cable port is for the scanner vehicle connector. Pressing the Yes button selects a menu or program or confirms a selection. Pressing the No button exits a menu or returns to the previous screen. The four-way keypad controls up, down, and left-right navigation. The shortcut S button can be programmed to perform a variety of routine tasks. We'll discuss this later in Tool Setup. To power up the Apollo D8, Press the power button. Apollo D8 also automatically powers up and opens to the home screen whenever it is connected to the vehicle or the AC power adapter. Apollo D8 will boot up to the home screen in about five seconds. All operation of Apollo D8 can be performed using the touch screen or the keys. To set up the tool, press the tools icon. Press Settings to enter the Settings menu. System Settings allows you to set Display, Date and Time, and Auto VIN. The Display menu allows you to change the brightness, color theme, and more. The Date and Time menu allows you to change the time zone, time and date format, and more. The Auto VIN menu allows you to turn the Instant ID feature on or off. Configure Wi-Fi has functions to turn on and connect the wireless internet. If the screen displays a message, Wi-Fi is off, press the Wi-Fi power icon to turn the Wi-Fi on. The Wi-Fi power icon will change from a checkmark icon to an X icon, indicating Wi-Fi radio is currently set to on. Select your desired network connection. Use the scroll feature to show all active connections. If the network is password protected, a keyboard will appear. Simply enter your network password. If your network does not require a password, select it. Select Connect to connect to your desired network. From the Connect Confirmation screen, select OK to continue using this connection or forget to disconnect this connection. The Configure Scanner menu gives options for showing or hiding the graph scales in data graphing mode. The Configure Units menu allows you to change between metric and imperial units. The System Information menu shows information about the tool, such as the serial number and installed software version. 
Configure Shortcut key allows you to set up what the S button on the front of the tool does when pressed. Choices for the Shortcut key function include Screen Brightness, Save Screen, Save Movie, Show Shortcut Menu, Toggle Record and Pause. Connect to PC allows you to connect the tool to your own PC using the supplied USB cable. You can then use the free ShopStream Connect software to view and print any saved files on the tool. Please visit this website and download the free application. Snap-on is dedicated to helping you get the most out of your diagnostic tool and keep your customers happy. Be sure to watch the rest of the modules in this training solutions series.